You got it. You got it. Welcome, YouTube. Pretty big one this week. We're uh, in Siena, Italy. Just me and Benj at the moment. The rest of the team are getting here in a couple of weeks. And we're working on a Michael Bay film called Six Underground. You might have heard of it. Today, we're going to show you the behind the scenes of one of the like bigger parkour stunts that we're doing, which is like jumping between a load of arches that are quite high up. It's, it's a pretty sick run, to be fair. But yeah, don't know how hard it's going to be. It's a scary one. These are the arches. Okay, so this is the arch spot. That is a really, really hard thing to do. The tops of these arches, I think you can see, have been put in by Jeffrey and his team. So before they had peaked arches that were like, you could not jump to. So they've added in these whole new sections to the top of the arches so that me and Drew can jump on them, which is absolutely insane. This isn't our choice of haircut. Um, Drew is doing the main stunt doubling for one of the characters, four, and ben I am Hardy. also doing it as well, a little bit, but I'm not. But I've got a haircut just in case. Yeah, Ben Hardy, he's been training with us. Cut to clips. I've been up there, yeah. What do you reckon? A confident jump, and just nice. Yeah. Yeah. It's more surprisingly cushy, isn't it? Yeah, really. Here's what I'm thinking is if Drew or Benj run. And the, this is where you're jumping. Yep, so it'd be so much easier for us if these two okay. aren't here. So just to fill you in, the stunt for this is we're coming from the top of this over here, over an alleyway down there, and then onto these tiled foam blocks here. But the problem that we had this morning is that these tiles here, so little landing room for your feet, and if you've got a wire on, you might actually get pulled onto like an ankle roll. So we're going to take away this middle column here, so it's safe for everyone. It looks better from the floor. Yeah, it does. But so, right to left. That is the gap there. Absolutely beautiful setting. It's a uh, 12 size 8 feet. Kind of droppy. Apart from that, we're good to go. Apart from the rain, we're not good to go. So this is the first time we're actually getting on top of the arches. It's raining, so we can't do it right now, but at least we can uh, put all our questions to rest. Ben's just headed on up. The pliers aren't small. I think, I think that's good. You could do that standing, this first one, and it's just a plier. That, it looks really nice. Yeah, the step good. down's better than I thought. Yeah. That's, that's fucking go. good, yeah. <laughs> that's so sick that it's better than we thought it was gonna be. Let's see you wanna get out, out the rain? Yeah, it's pretty shit, isn't it? Yeah. Let's go. Let's go. It could dry up today, maybe not, but we're running out of time to prep before we shoot it, so. Is it possible to prep on the day? Right now, it's not happening. Okay. Yeah, I don't, I don't think it's getting done today, personally. But, like, fortunately, from the look we had up there, it's nicer than we thought. So, like, I'm not too worried if we can get an hour or a couple of hours before before we shoot, then that's cool. Yeah, that's like, fine, isn't it? Yeah. Everyone, this is Richard. Hello, mate. Say hello. hello to the vlog. Hello, everybody. Richard is in charge of making us look proper cool. Stylish. Stylish. Big up Richard for the ultra boosts. <laughs> Great shout. <laughs> guess oh, guess who's who? I'm Ben. I'm Drew. Uh, Fresh trim. His hair and makeup and everything finished. So they're going to travel us to set. And we'll find out what we're doing because today we don't actually know. Hopefully we get back to doing the arches, but yeah, could be literally anything. So get warmed up and get ready to do whatever they throw at us, basically. Story pickup on the way to set now. Okay, so Drew's just getting prepped up there right now. We're having to do this rooftop scene with a wire, which is obviously not what we're used to. You know we're not used to that. Um, but we're working for Netflix in this production, so for health and safety reasons, they simply can't let us do these rooftop scenes without a wire. I mean, it's not our kind of style. It's probably harder with a wire as well, because it kind of gets in the way and limits your movement a little bit. But it's, if it's got to be done, it has to be done and we'll make do. But I think Drew's just running through some rehearsals right now. Michael Bay's just about to turn up and uh, get ready to shoot, I think. Why are you wearing gloves? Yeah. 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 Yeah.
It's on, we've finally been cleared to give the arts jumps an actual go. So me and Drew are just warming up right now. It's happening, but this last prep isn't giving me much confidence. Yeah, the windowsill stride is hard. You can't really practice it perfectly on the ground. So doing the best we can, warming up, and uh, give us the best chance of success when we get up to the top. The alleyway is getting filled with boxes. We're almost ready to go. Everything's in place. Feeling ready, feeling prepared. I just want to get like, get out there and fucking do it now. It's been yeah. so long. Do you know what I mean? That's what we're here to do, is fucking get some jobs done. That's the thing though, when we're up on the arches, that's when we're in our element. This costume, fucking around, boxes, wires, that's like out of our comfort zone because it's new to us. As soon as we're up there training, it's just like, sick. Like click straight back into mode and like what do you need to do to make this comfortable, figure it out, bash it out, complete it. No boxes needed, hopefully. Ooh. Yeah, do you reckon there'll be a fool if we make this shout now? Do you reckon we'll use the boxes at any point? My vote is no. I don't think at any time any point we'll use boxes. Unless at the end we do it for fun. <laughs> okay, lucky for us, we've got some next level entry. Welcome to my home. Well, the obvious difficulty is if they're filling this alley with boxes, how the fuck are we going to get up or down when we need to? So, spotted these little windows. We can easily get out, easily get back in, and then just hop around the building and out to the other one. The boxes are still a long way down, to be fair. So, this is, this is what we're doing. So, starting on here, we tic-tac in this small little windowsill, stride or plyo this, and then this is the big one from here over to here. So all we're waiting for now is the remaining boxes to be filled in on these gaps, and then we're good to start sending these jumps. One more box coming in. This is the last box, and then we're jumping between these arches. Shit, this is gonna be cool. <sighs> okay, here we fucking go. Finally get to do what we're for. Okay. Wow. That's awkward as hell. Okay, okay, so what you don't know, right, is this is the exact first time that no. we've stood on this. Okay. Not yet. Yeah. You guys gotta do yeah. to make it work for you. Okay. <laughs> if any either of us want to do it, one of us go on the other side just to make sure you don't over. The first over time doing this. Yeah. Yeah, that was alright. <laughs> <laughs> Let's go. Building power off it, but I guess we just got Yeah, do that, do that four or five times. So this is the this is the next level of the challenge. Is making it over yeah, level 11, one 11 feet to the next one. Level 11 feet. Um, I could bounce that. I could on a good day. I'm like getting crane. Yeah. But I feel like with that stride momentum, I'm really like confident yeah. distance wise. Get power out of that. Yeah. Challenge up yeah, to yeah, maybe yeah. the last stage. Ben's just gonna. Ben's just ready to give it a, a fucking go. Let's go. Ready? Stay calm. <laughs> do the unlock. Stay there. Meet over. Go do the last jump and then figure out the descent and then hopefully we've unlocked all the parts. And then we just gotta get really, really fucking comfortable with it. Bang it out. Bang it out. Call it a night and then hold it for, for whenever we're supposed to be shooting this, which looks like a couple of days. It's a tough one. It's a fucking tough one. We're ready to rock! Let's fucking go. Boom, baby! Hit it. 
<laughs> yeah, how was it then? Oh, it's so bad. Really, it's, it's fucking bad, nothing. Yeah. Like, Sick. Do you want to film from there? You got it, you got it. It's like so tough to first like break through that barrier of like being scared of something and you just gotta, it's a maze in your head. It's a maze in your head and you just gotta find the right path. But when you do, that's when you know to go. Okay, that's why. That's why you use boxes. Obviously, sometimes when you go for it, it's not right. And Drew felt something and backed out last minute, which typically is the worst thing you can possibly do. Like, I should have just done this like three, four more times. Yeah, yeah. Like I wasn't nervous at all, and then I came here. And then it just sides, and it's like, fuck oh, off. So fucking nice. Thank you. Ciao. Ciao, che me lo riprendi. Oddio, ora guardo, eh. Going out the window. Mi fa paura. Fa paura. So the lads have just replaced the boxes. Now it's time for us to give some more takes a go. Got it, thank you. Woo, that feels nice. <laughs> I think I'm ready for one. Yeah, that's it. Yeah, I'm gonna do it one more time. Okay. Nice and cash. You got it. Yeah. <laughs> what, what looks like the impossible, <laughs> these guys are the men. Can you get it done? <laughs> that was a fucking intense little session. The pressure, I didn't think it would get to me, mm -hmm. but it absolutely did. And it's funny, in the clip before, I was like, I don't think we use the fucking boxes. <laughs> we use the boxes. I think the pressure would get to me that bad. And it's like, just before you send it, in my head, I built it up because so many people watching and like, as it's like we have no option but to do the jump. It's like you just gotta fucking do it, which is such the wrong decision to make. But luckily we have boxes, thanks stuntmen, so I didn't die. Stay calm, stay smooth. That equals power and speed. Don't go off adrenaline. It doesn't fucking work because your body makes you do stuff that you aren't conscious of, like backing out and jumping to your back. But. uh yeah, sick to finally get it ticked off after all this build up. When it comes to shooting, Michael Bay's behind the camera. Ready, three, two, one, all on. We can fucking, we can fucking do it. Muscle memory now. Here on this. So I want to get, we want to get a handheld. So what's happening today? So today we're doing the roof gap that we were doing sort of the tiles for the other day. Uh, technically, this jump that Drew's doing is actually not too bad. Um, it's just, it gets a bit confusing and it gets a bit hectic in the moment to stay concentrated, stay focused in on the jump. How are you feeling? Yeah, good. Morning, Zach. How Morning. You? Fantastic. Here we are. What? Getting ready to do the big gag. Mr. Fucking Clown and then bus. Right, so, so the tiles we're looking at here are for the jump. So we're going to start on this ridge, step down, right, and jump across this gap. I need you to start yeah. putting your harness on. Though. So coming in down here onto this lovely ply setup that they've made for us over this gap. Realistically, the jump isn't that big. It's kind of droppy, but um, 
they've, they've put some spongy tiles underneath the wooden wooden ply which is really nice so it might give it like a soft sponge to the to the landing so i think once drew's done it for the first time he's going to actually really enjoy it put your you hood in the back Toby? a little bit feeling great mate yeah. 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 Gravy, mate. Yeah. First time they're only the they're only wire. seeing this yeah. bit so yeah for okay. now so for this first one just for you just yeah. whatever you need start buddy whatever i want yeah this is where I'm going to start from for this. That's where okay. you're going to start? Yeah. And you got your landing? Yeah. Okay. Yes, we're 100%. Drew, can you put your hood up? Hood up. Yeah, because they're rolling on this. They're going to roll in rehearsal. He told me to put my hood down. Here we down. go. Three, Three two, two, one, action. Nice. Yeah, it's all right, to be fair. Like a little bit of impact. Okay. Yeah. Yeah, it's fine. Just like a little bit of impact, exactly what you expect. Yeah. yeah. Hey, wave your hand where you go. Be your very hand aware of the line. Wave your hand where you go. Three, two, one, two, one. Be in the air. Nice. So this is head. now this your first shot of the movie. First shot of the movie. How are you feeling? I'm feeling good. Is Toe all right? Yeah, it's there, feeling there, good. There, good. There. Okay, sweet. Roll it. Weird. Yeah, it's strange, isn't it? So, um, because of my dislocated toe injury, I don't think I'm going to give another one a go. So, all of this is on Drew again. Sorry about the gloves, parkour people. I know parkour people don't wear gloves. It's not our choice, obviously. They're actually quite sick. Look at these. It's crazy, like, the intensity of it. Like, waiting there for ages. And then, like, suddenly it's like, okay, go, go, go. You've got to get it done. But, Luckily the jump's like, I mean it's impact, but technically it's, it's completely fine. And sweet his toe, so it looks like I'm going to have to do it a few more. Michael, everybody's getting nervous. Yeah, have you ever heard of Bayhem YouTube? This is what it's all about. Bayham. This is gonna be fucking sick because I'm actually like fully set this up. So I'm gonna cause fucking shitload of hail. So the plan is he's gonna run across this little set of this like, and all of this shit is gonna go everywhere. He's gotta be able to go over there, see the up in one corner. You know what I'm saying? Okay, so I feel like this scene's gonna be an absolute Bayhem scene. I don't know. This I believe there's Bricks and metal beams gonna go flying everywhere. Set off by Drew. Fuck yeah, I can't wait to cause that much havoc. In yeah, one that's... swift flick of my wrist. This is the thing. I'm not actually Irish, although my accent's convincing. This is really weirdly a, a house, an active house. This is his family of allowed us. Hello, ciao. Or well, allowed the movie in, obviously. I hope they paid them. Michael's just megaphoned me and said, I'm gonna run across and cut something with this knife. I don't know what, and I wanna check so I don't do it wrong. Because I think cars come, it set something off, and like, there's a huge chain reaction from this knife. So I've gotta get it wrong. Oh shit, did you see that guy wearing a story shirt? No. Oh, there we are. That is an original story to you right there. Oh. 
Okay, you're on a leash, of course. Okay, we're in a new day. Today, today is our day where we're jumping the arches for real on tape. We need to go do that now. Then. Yeah, let's go prepping. Okay, so we've literally just got the call. The main unit are on their way over, so it's time for go, go, go on the arches. I mean, we're ready to go. We've already done it. It's all good. We've got this in the bag. It's just the pressure of the main unit shoot. There's gonna be a lot of cameras, a lot of people, a lot of voices. It's about staying focused, staying calm, staying in the moment. We know what we have to do and then executing it to perfection like we always do. I mean, by the end of last session, we had it like fairly casual. We had it confidently and we we're having fun with it. So and now it's just about getting that on camera. It's yeah. like we've done the hard bit now. I just got to capture it. All right. So guys, do your thing. don't get comfortable. I'm going to carry him down. Okay. okay. Everyone's here. Shoot time. Hey, right, Drew, do another one with your camera. Yeah. I think he's about to go for one there. There we are. We're in place, Michael Bay setting up the camera angles right now. This is the day, this is it. Check it out, the whole crew's here. Absolute dream setup we have right here. We've got a nice little camera arm over here. That's um, gonna come like all the way through and under as we're doing it, I think. So um, the shot's gonna be fucking amazing. Shoot the shit out. Of this they're gonna shoot the shit out of it. Yeah, the only problem is like, we're like four days into movement right now and our legs are feeling very, very wavy. Me and Drew are taking it in turns to save our legs. Start inside the window. What, and do the whole thing? Yeah, can you do that? No. We have to, we have to concentrate really hard on the first step. Okay, gotcha. Yeah. Right. I'm not a hardcore motherfucker. <laughs> <laughs> Drew's on his 7th attempt of the day. We've had two warm-up jumps, two POV attempts, and now this is going to be your third on main unit camera. I've just done my third on main unit. I reckon we're halfway through our stint, if that. Our legs are seizing. Yeah, it's get a fucking shot. <laughs> yeah, that's good. <laughs> this window still is like a nice petty bit, and the next jump is the biggest. All right. Good You've got to do what you got to do to get the shot. Is this okay with you guys? Yeah, that's, yeah, that's perfect. Good. Right? Getting the shot right here. Let's fucking go. Fucking sick. Parkour on movies, this is fucking fun. We're just getting reps in now. Yeah, I don't care about my legs now, it's too fun. He's so hyped for this. Like, yeah. He's so hyped for this. I love the commitment to the shot, that is sick. Like, he's not afraid to get in it. Move that crane get even a wider shot so you can go higher, get into the street and go up and down, okay? That's a tick for that angle. We've got the shot, um, moving to the next angle. Michael's currently trying to wiggle his way down through the boxes. Tricky shit. I think that's it for the jumps. Fucking sick. Big up. Yes. Fucking smashed through it. I've lost count of how many times we've done that today. I kind of like plateaued like five deep. So right now what's happening, they're gonna pull in a van. So after we've done the descent down here, we're gonna drop down to a van and then escape, motherfucker. He's gonna hang okay. from there and then he's gonna drop to the truck and this line will make sure that he can't fall off. Gotcha. Is this my first blog? This is your first You guys blog. just my first blog. Well, welcome to Story Blog. All right, well, don't follow me because I'm not on there. <laughs> so the final shot of the scene is just about to go down. We're waiting for the three, two, one, go, and it's about to happen. Yeah, that makes sense because I was like, 
you can feel like what I want to do. I was like pushing up and it comes and I was like, who's doing that? Actually <laughs> <laughs> done guys. Yeah, nice Aaron. You guys rock. <laughs> <laughs> Ooh, that is it. Our legs are numb. Dead. Dead. Absolutely dead. Thank you for watching the video. Um, subscribe because there's much more movie content coming your way very soon. We've got the whole boys out in Budapest. It's going to be fucking If you nice. want to watch the film, exclusively available on Netflix, Six Underground. Alright guys, that's it. <coughs> Over and out. Peace.